So it's 9 a.m. We are headed into Manhattan to photograph some agent headshots for a commercial brokerage on 3rd Avenue at between 51st and 52nd Street. So it's gonna be a pretty expensive ride. Let's actually find out how much it's gonna cost. So it's only $56. That's actually not bad. So we're going to select lift. Okay, so the only other issue is that it's only 35 degrees which means that Tofu is not allowed outside. So I have to actually move him into the bathroom so that I can get out of the apartment without him trying to run. So it sucks, but that's what we have to do. Sorry, little guy. I know you want to go out. I know you want to go out. It's not warm enough, honey. Good morning. And look at the lens. Okay, so we are headed to 3rd Avenue between 51st and 52nd Street to shoot corporate headshots for a commercial brokerage. I was told between eight and 10 agents that I'm photographing, but you really don't know how that is because wrangling agents for a headshot is actually pretty hard. And just so you know, tofu is not kept in the bathroom when I leave, but the way that my apartment is configured, I have to move him into the bathroom so that I can open the front door without him running out. Then as I leave, I open the bathroom door and he can then have access to the full apartment. Right now, he has to stay in the apartment, but when I get back, hopefully it'll be warm enough for him to go out. I'd really like him to be able to go out today because it's supposed to snow tomorrow. So I'd like him to have a day out to run his errands and uh, take care of his cat business. Thank you. Hang in the truck. Hi. Hi, Callie. How are you? I'm okay. Here you go. I'm not too late. This is okay. actually really good timing. So do you know how we normally do this? Oh, okay. I got some stuff to move. So basically, I'm going to set up right where that is. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Nice for you to just saunter in. How are you? All right. I need to come get the... Um, like, did we just start shooting in front of the wall? So I'm just gonna move the table, set up lights, and I'll be ready to go. Cool. How are you? Good. Okay, so probably lean like 15 more minutes to, um... Oh, yeah. Well, I'll come find you? Yeah. Okay. I'll be around. Good to see you. So it's a little ghetto, but I don't have enough mounts for my Cam Ranger, so I connected it through the carabiner to a peak design strap so I can still shoot with my cam ranger but um, yeah works how are you doing hi how are you did you get something to, or you're good I'm good for now all right I'm gonna go find Rachel because she's my first person okay to... do you want me to walk you up to where she oh that'd be great okay so you're gonna stand on the lens cap and then Let's I want you it. to turn slightly. Oh, look at you. So oh, that's nice. All right, so we're just gonna take a few and then just, you know, be comfortable. You look fantastic. All right, so you're gonna stand right above that, just so you're a little bit farther away from the wall. All right, so now here's the fun part. Oh, look at you. All right, let's do another set. Give me a couple with your hands, just a little bit more relaxed, good. Friendly and confident. 
<laughs> this one looks confident. Think so? Wait, let's look at this one compared to this one. Yeah, I like that so one. This one or this one? Uh, the, 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 this yeah, one? This one. Okay, this one. Oh yeah, that's the dub. Those were the two. Hello. Hi. And then turn your head like that. Okay. Good. Okay. Perfect stop. How many shots do we get? As many as it takes to get one that everyone likes. Oh, that's good. I like that. All right, let's take a look. Okay, great. Yes. So you like this one? Yes. Okay, I agree perfect. With you. Perfect. I think it looks, well, as perfect as can be. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you for your help. Appreciate Absolutely. it. Absolutely. So you are now number six. Okay. How are you doing? Good. How are you? I'm really good. Let's get you over here. Okay. You're going to stand right above that. Above this. Yep, like this. so come here. And then, do you have a favorite side? Um, I feel like this side. Like... Okay, so bring this leg forward. Okay. Turn that, and then turn your chest a little bit towards me. Good. I think these look really good. Come take a look. Oh, nice. Thank you so much. Yeah, that was, cool. look how easy that was. Yeah. Oh, great. Now, here's the thing. I know my angles. I'm really annoying. I'm uh -huh. old, and I just want it to look fresh, young. And whatever you have to do, just make this go away. Like, see this? I don't even know what you're talking about. I don't even know what you're talking about. I do, so. Oh, God. <laughs> she does, because we talk about it all the time. All right. Friendly and confident. That's the goal. Oh, my God. Jess, you look amazing. Look right there. Jess, you look amazing. <laughs> all right. Come take a look. This one I like. This That's one, right? a one, yes. No, Annie. Like is, is she the last one? Annie should be the last one. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> totally <laughs> killing it. Yeah. All right. One, two, three. There we go. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Annie, Go take a look. Took, all right, you, you have like 15 photos you can choose from that are like really mm. good. Who's that? I did. I'm not making this up. You look really good in your photos. Do you have any more appointments for today? No, I have. I am done. I'm going back oh, to bed. Going back so to bed. fast. It, it goes really quickly. Oh, so fast. It really does go quickly. I mean, it's pretty straightforward. Okay, so we're all packed up and we're heading back to Brooklyn. We shot eight brokers, which is a, a nice payday. Ah, that's stupid to say. <sighs> okay, so um, back from my first trip into Manhattan. Photo shoot went well. It was great. Um, it's 1.19 p.m. It's 45 degrees. I'm gonna let Mr. Tofu head out and then I'm gonna call my mom. And then I actually have to go back into the city to um, deal with some stuff at Fish's Eddie with Ben. I think it's time to let this guy go be wild for a couple hours. Don't, I'm trying to let you, why are you doing this? Hi. I do. I had to do this because when people would steal him, I had to prove to the police that he's mine. So I. Uh, he goes out during the day as long as it's over 45 degrees. Okay. And then at night I go out and look for him. And you know how I find him? I jingle my keys. But you know, once they know that the world exists, they can't stay in an apartment all day long. Man, I know the feelings. I said, dogs, are, cats are just like human beings. Mm. They got feelings just like us. Yep, yep, yep. Thank you. Take care. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Hello. Hey. How are you doing, kiddo? I'm good. How are you? I'm, uh, I'm doing pretty good myself. Did I catch your bedtime? Hey, how's your um, filming going? It's, a <laughs> it's, going, it's going really well. It's actually Great. going really well. Um, I've, I've figured out a lot in terms of like storytelling, like how I'm going to make these little episodes work. All right. So we are finally outside of the apartment. We are on our way to Fish's Eddie to photograph Ben's studio 
one last time before he takes it apart because he's going out of town and so he's basically subleasing his gallery space inside of Fish's Eddy to another artist. We need to photograph, look at the lens, we need to photograph his gallery before he takes it apart and subleases the space to another artist. So let's find out how to get to Fish's Eddy. I technically know how to get to Fish's Eddy, but I would like to see if there is an alternate route. All right, so it looks like we're taking the Uptown 4 or 5 at Fulton, which obviously is how you need to go. Whatever, let's go, bye. It's actually a lot colder. Or I just completely dress inappropriately. I don't know where Tofu is. I'm assuming he's inside of someone's apartment because he's not out on the street. Fuck, do I have my keys? All right, so I don't have my keys. Which means I can't be out too late because if I need to buzz a neighbor, I don't want to do it when they're supposed to be asleep. Oh, I got my keys. All right, I can stay out as long as I want. So since we're traveling to the 4-5 at Fulton, we can walk to the front of the train because that's where we're going to transfer to the 4-5. Hold on, I have to my shoe. Okay, what time is it? 3.51 p.m. and we should be getting onto the train any second. Hey Ben, I'm at Fulton Street catching the 4-5. All right, so we just got out of the 4-5 train. We're at Union Square Park, walking over to Fish's Eddy. All right, so we're at Fish's Eddy. Let's uh, go see Ben. Hi. How are you? I'm good, how are you? Hi. How are you? So let's talk about what we want to do today. I'll show you the shots that I would like to take. Okay, so here, hold this. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to back out so that we get as much of the room without getting these walls. So without getting these door gems. That shows the whole space, right? Yeah, yep. And we like this? It's never been done before, yep, that's exactly <laughs> yep. Okay, I mean, we can do your angle shot, but there's a, no, there's a very architectural yes. look to doing it um, straight on. Okay. And, uh, and I kind of want to at least get something like this. So we like that angle. Yeah, that's okay. Cool. And that's even to the floor. Okay, that we're happy with this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so I'm gonna... Hi, I'm Jimmy. Yeah, Tommy, Tommy. You. and you are the... the metro yes, I'm, I've met him like 20 times. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. And actually, you were just on our uh, Instagram because account. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you think, I feel like it looks a little junky, like all this stuff, maybe it should be just square. Just so straight on? Yeah, I think okay. so. Okay. All right, this bad boy is done. It looks like everything's back to where it was. Okay. Okay? Are, are you okay. Uh, walking to Union Square? I can be. Where are you going? Thank you, though. That's very kind of you. See ya. Do you want to get some ice cream for a minute? Do you want ice cream? Do you want ice cream? You don't eat ice cream. You don't eat ice cream. Like it. Is there really a vegan yeah, it's ice cream? Really good. Yeah. Do you like it? I, we can get ice cream, yeah, but uh, what are you getting? Uh, can I get a, the you have the this is vegan chocolate, right? You want to make chocolate chocolate on top? A small cup of cones. A cup? Just uh, just plain plain cup. Yeah, yeah. What, what flavor? Um, can I do the green pistachio thing here? Is 
in a, uh, the small is. Thank you, Ben. Thank you. Okay, so we're done with Fish's Eddie. Had ice cream with Ben. Now we're at the 14th Street Station taking the A or the C home. You know, here's the thing. The A is faster, but you can generally get a seat on the C. So I've given the choice right now, I'd rather, I'd rather sit. I'd rather have the C train and be able to sit down. So let's see what shows up first. I can look. All right, so we are on the home stretch back to the apartment. The only thing we have to do tonight is find tofu and uh, I guess eat dinner. I really wanted to do laundry tonight, but I don't see that happening. But I don't have any shoots scheduled for the rest of the week, so I can do laundry any day this week. So now the question is, can we get tofu? Let me see if I can find this air tag. <sighs> All right, let's see if I can find tofu's air tag. It's funny because when I play back this footage of me ringing my keys, jingling my keys, Tofu will hear the footage and he'll immediately perk up wherever he's sleeping from. All right, so no Tofu. I'm guessing he's not outside. All right, I guess we gotta play the long game. Looking for Tofu tonight. Okay, so I got a ping from Tofu's AirTag, so we're gonna run downstairs and see if we can get him home. Okay, so no Tofu. I'm fairly certain if he were outside, he would be coming in. Okay, no Tofu. Okay, it's 8.07 p.m. Look at the lens. It's 8.07 p.m. and we got a tofu ping. He should be nearby, so I'm gonna run downstairs and see if I can find him. All right, let's go. Up. Oh. Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? All right, let's go inside. Can I pick you up? Okay. Okay. And with that, another vlog ends. So the first thing that we did today was photograph some agent headshots at Lean Associates, which is a brokerage on Third Avenue. Photographing broker headshots is fun, but a little tricky. Agents generally aren't signed models and don't have out of this world expectations of what they should be looking like in a headshot. They just wanna look nice. So in that regard, it's super easy. But there are those agents who absolutely do not want their headshot taken. They don't wanna be photographed. They're not willing participants and you gotta do the best you can because at the end of the day, the marketing team and the executives need these headshots. So let's take a look. So this is actually the raw file. The agent has a great smile, her makeup is clean, hair is easy, outfit is simple and straightforward, elegant. And this is the edited shot. So there wasn't a whole lot that we had to do. We brightened the teeth up, which we do for everyone regardless and you know just brightened up her eyes this is a great headshot she was totally prepared she looks fantastic this guy here he did not want his photo taken like he didn't care about his hair like it just it was hard and this is what we did to his hair and you know cleaned up some of his skin just to give him a better looking headshot does he look like this in real life i probably don't think so this is what the marketing team wanted. So this is actually, this is what you get, homie. You don't show up to the photo shoot ready, I'll Photoshop that shit. 
Rachel, I love Rachel. Totally ready for this. She looked great, great smile. And this is the editing, super straightforward, super easy. She, uh, she nailed it. So it's great when agents, you know, they come prepared and they're, they're all about making sure that their headshot looks fantastic. Yay. After the headshot shoot, I went down to Fish's Eddie and met up with Ben. Ben had a chance to review the shots from the previous shoot, and I think he wanted to have his actual workstation removed from the shots. And so we did a reshoot where we took his workstation out of the room. And you know, we, uh, we did our shift stitches. So that's the top, that's our middle, that's our bottom. That's what the edited shot looks like, but you know, I feel like it's a little too top heavy. Like the stuff that's happening up there didn't really make no sense. So I, I cropped it down, but now I, it, it, like, I, it makes the room look small. So I'm not quite sure if this is a shot that we're gonna use. Here we have a detail in one of the corners. And so that's our top shot. That's our middle shot. That's our bottom shot. And then that's the edited shot. And that's the cropped version of the edited shot. This was an interesting shot because we had, Ben gave me very specific parameters of what he wanted in the shot and what he didn't want in the shot. So we did a shift stitch, but I don't know that this was necessary. So that's our top shot. That's our middle shot. That's our bottom shot. This is the edited shot. And then this is the cropped shot. I can see this being used in his brochure so I like this shot because it shows the different frames that he sells with each of his portraits. You can actually pick the frame that you want. Some of them cost more, which is fine. So I think I did exactly what I needed to do. I needed to photograph the new brokers at Lee & Associates, and I needed to supplement the shots that I took for Ben of his sales gallery. So it was a good day. It was a good day. Thanks for watching this video. I'll catch you in the next one. Did that make sense? Um, yeah, that was super easy. Okay, I think we're done with that.